Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Friends, today I am going to show you how to do filming of CT scan brain on Advantage Workstation version 4.6. There are multiple types of filming in brain scan. First is brain plane, second is brain plane plus contrast, third is brain plus bony window when patient is having trauma. Fourth is you have to do filming according to patient is having a lesion inside the brain. Sometimes patient is having intracranial hemorrhage. In that cases, you have to give coronal and sagittal reconstruction in films. Sometimes patient is having subdural or extradural hematoma. Sometimes patient is having multiple contusions. Sometimes patient is having tumor in that cases, you should give sagittal and coronal reconstruction without fail because neurosurgeon needs that images while doing operation. Okay, I will uh, I will show you how to give the filmings. First of all, we will see brain plane. Whenever you are doing a brain plane scan only. You should give format of 30 images, okay, with scanner. It will looks good. Click on a filmer. You can enter the images in film by pressing F1 on keyboard, okay. First of all, select the starting point and ending point of the scan and check out how many images you have taken in that scan from here you have to start you should give first image from here and next image cerebellum is going to start this is the cerebellum medulla so you should give this is this should be your starting point and ending point should be over here high frontoparietal this sinus you should keep in mind so starting point should be this i'll show you from here the cerebellum is starting so you should give from here in soft tissue window this should be your starting point and ending point should be over here here the sinus ends this is high frontoparietal region okay so select 30 images format you should click on this custom 5 by 6 format you can enter the images manually with f1 or i have shown the technique how to create a batch with a loop method with that pattern also you can create a films double click on you can refer to my previous videos in that there are multiple settings of filming i have shown in that images first image you should give scano for reference okay this much zoom you have to give in the film you should not cut the images in films keep in mind this much zoom you should give always this is the plain brain plain brain film okay 30 images if patient is having trauma and you need to give a bony image bony window images select the same format 5 by 6 and enter the same images and give this much of zoom okay for bony window second film is for bony window okay third film if you are giving filming for ct scan brain plus contrast what you have to do this is the first image okay first film for plane sections same you have to give for 5 by 6 you have to select the format and simply add second film for that so you're going to give two films for 
CT scan brain plain plus contrast. First would be plain images and second would be contrast images. 5 by 6 format, 30 images for plain and 30 images for contrast. So, 2 films for contrast. If your patient is having something, tumor or subdural or extradural, you should include one film extra like this. Simply click on the layout and you have to add. I have added two formats 15 by 15. Uh, this is a total 30 images. I have given 15 images for coronal and 15 images for sagittal view. If your center is having no problem for giving flames, you can give full flame for coronal view and full flame for sagittal view. That will cause too much, I think. So this will be okay. You should enter 15 images for coronal and 15 images for sagittal view. So this is how you are going to give MPR when patient is having subdural hematoma, extradural hematoma, large intracerebral hematoma or any tumor. Okay. This is how you have to give films for different type of diagnostic images. So I hope you like my video. Please like, share and subscribe my channel and press bell icon for more updates. Thanks for watching.